Hi there. Now I'd like to share with you today a really gorgeous engine. And this is a Canadian made Super Hurricane. And it's a Super Hurricane 24, which is 0.24 cubic inches, which equates to about, I think it's 4cc. And this is a spark ignition engine, which is kind of of the time in the, in the late 30s, 1940s. Now this engine, was preceded by uh, three other kind of variations on the Hurricane but this version, the Super Hurricane, came out in December of 1945 and it was only produced for about two years in, in 1948 it was changed subtly, some of the castings were, were different and it had a more streamlined fuel tank on the back so we can pin the age of this down really accurately and you can see this 1945 advert here from December and uh, just announcing the new Super Hurricane and uh, what a great advert. Now we'll take a closer look at this now and then uh, I think we need to get it in the test stand but let's have a closer look first. As you can see this is a gorgeous looking engine I just love the swept back fins on the back of the cylinder there and we can see we've got made in Canada on the, the bottom of the crankcase there and if we turn it over we can see the Super Hurricane 24 on the crankcase on that side. Now if we turn it on its end we can see the, the shape of those fins just sweeping back in the head and how really nice that looks. Now on this model you can just see the fins sticking out on the, uh, on the back here, these lower the, those lower fins. Now on the model that came in in 1948 apparently if you look down from the top you can't see those fins like that. And on the front here, spark ignition engine, we've got the timer and we've got this lever to advance and retard the, uh, the ignition. So what a great looking engine and I, I don't think this has had much much use. If it has been run, I don't think it's been run a lot. It's certainly in, in lovely condition, pristine condition to my mind. And uh, I was really excited to be able to get, get hold of this. And we can just see in the top there, don't know whether you can read that, but it's a, it's a Champion v uh, V2 spark plug. Well, as you just saw, this is a gorgeous looking engine. And I just love those swept back fins. And I guess they're there to try and get a kind of a uniform cooling all around the cylinder. Uh, so increasing the, the surface area where you haven't got quite so much airflow perhaps. But I do absolutely love the look of this engine. But you know what? We've got to get it in the test stand and see how it runs. Right, well, I've got this lovely Super Hurricane 24 clamped in the test stand and it's all ready to go. I'm dead excited to see how this runs and I'm going to be running it on a 10x6 wooden Falcon prop. So let's see if we can get this thing fired up. Lead came off the back. I pulled it off with my sleeve, I think. That's a shame. Let's put this back on and we'll have another go. Right. <laughs> Can't blame the engine for that.
Well, that ran lovely. I get such a buzz out of running these lovely old spark ignition engines that are what? I don't know, 70, 75 years old. It's a real joy to hear them come back to life. And I think this ran beautifully on this 10x6 prop. What were we getting? We were getting about seven, seven and a half thousand RPM. I think we even touched 8,000 at one point. So I am really pleased with this. I mean, the more I run these old Spark engines, the more you get to understand the ignition and, and, and how they start and how they run. And this is a real joy for me, a great learning curve. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed watching this run as much as I enjoyed running it. Thanks very much for watching.